My name is Bruno Haug. I'm leading the technology group of Swisscom TV. Swisscom delivers Swisscom TV to our customer. It's a fully converged product for web and mobile and also set the box in the best picture quality that is available on the market. Our vision is that we can deploy new channels, remove new channels, update new channels by one click. That means the guy in the business should be able to deploy new services in a very fast time frame. Don't talk about weeks or months as he has today. We talk about minutes and our goal is today to deploy a new service in, within 10 minutes. Our key requirement was that we automate everything. And virtualization is the way to go, to virtualize and automate the whole process. And the whole system will be based on the OpenStack cloud. We also will use a part of open source tools like FFmpeg. We started with this in the past where we start the project. The key driver for us is cost saving, time to market and also have, don't have a hard vendor locking. The virtual header is very different from a normal header, I would say, where everything is based on appliance, different hardware, different vendors. In the virtualization we, have a we are using standard hardware. On top we have a virtualization layer with Red Hat and KVM. Zero packet loss is very important for the picture quality because every packet that you lose in the headend you cannot recover. We have a second headend where we are using for disaster recovery if the main headend fails. We have also extended the additional number of channels for the future and also we have to migrate from SD to HD channels in this second headend for disaster case. We work together with HP Science years in the TV area because they have a deep knowledge, especially on the infrastructure side, virtualization, automation and orchestration. This is one of the big topics in our vision, our project. Our goal was when we start together or looking for a partner that the partner is independent, he has no stakes in transcoding, encoding. So we were looking for an integrator, an integrator that we can trust. And by then it was HP. We started the project in the HP lab in Rome uh, with a proof of concept to prove our concept and test our concept with open source component. We started with uh, Ateme Titan Live transcoding to integrate it in the virtual header management and also worked together with Harmonic with the Harmonic was components and probing in a headend, especially virtualized probing where we work together in a quest. And HP bring all these three, four parties on the one umbrella system. Afterwards, we moved it to our data center to have an end-to-end, -end, fully end-to-end -end chain from the signal acquisition to our middleware to the MPBR system back to, towards to our set of box and mobile clients. Swisscom is working in an agile mode, especially in the TV area. We work on the Scale Agile framework and we also work together with HP development team in Rome in the same mode as we work together. It helps us that we can deliver in B-weekly sprints. We have always a drop where we can test, install, test the new functionality and also give feedback back to the developer parts. And it makes us faster in developing, also in bug fixing. Our HP as an organization is called uh, HP Point Next. They involve the right people they bring in the right people from around the world to solve the issue or the issue, the challenge on the virtualized network. Because in the head end, you should have no packet loss. And that was the main goal. And HP solved together with us this challenge. They also co developed some changes in the OpenStack organization. We started with HP Helion and then we moved backwards in our data center to Red Hat. And now HP works together with Red Hat and Swisscom for the base layer on the OpenStack environment. The current state of the virtual header management solution is today that we have in Swisscom, we already launched a couple of channels and our goal is to extend it to a lot more of channels by end of this year. HP took the lead to integrate all the different technology companies from transcoding, from the OpenStack, from the infrastructure side and HP took everything together on the one umbrella system.